the sentence that will likely keep Keith Raniere, that leader of that so-called sex cult, behind bars for the rest of his life. This morning, we're hearing exclusively from Dynasty star Catherine Oxenberg, the mother of one of his victims. Amy is here with that this morning. Good morning, Amy. That's right. Good morning, Michael Raniere, who described himself as a self-help guru, was sentenced at a federal court in Brooklyn to 120 years behind bars. At the sentencing, his victims told their tales of terror, and now Catherine Oxenberg is opening up about getting closure for her daughter and her family. This morning, vindication for victims of so-called sex cult leader Keith Raniere. Keith Raniere will not be able to, uh, to victimize people anymore uh, after today's sentence, and we're, we're very grateful for that. Tuesday, the founder of the self-help group Nexium sentenced to 120 years behind bars for charges including racketeering, sex trafficking, and forced labor. Several former members of his organization sharing their relief outside of court. Yeah. This is the finale for him. Um, his uh, victimization of people, his terrorizing people, um, it really is over. 120 years, right? So when I got over my shock, I was like, yeah, yeah, okay, he can't come for me now. So one would say authenticity is being as you are. Prosecutors say Ranieri, known as Vanguard to his followers, was a con man and a predator who exploited women, blackmailing them to be his slaves, have sexual relationships with him, and having them branded with his initials. It was the most inhumane, horrific way to treat anybody. In court Tuesday, Ranieri maintaining his innocence, calling his victims free-thinking adults. More than a dozen former members confronting him in court, delivering impact statements, including India Oxenberg, who joined the group when she was 19 years old. Emotional at times, telling the judge Ranieri stole seven years of her life, calling him a sexual predator, adding, I will be a victim of Keith Ranieri for the rest of my life, but I don't need to live as one. India's mother, Dynasty star Catherine Oxenberg, spent years publicly fighting to free India from the group. How's your daughter doing in heaven's book? My, my daughter is, uh, is, is still on the inside. She's not, not back yet. This morning, Catherine speaking out exclusively to GMA. I did everything that I could in my power to stop this man from abusing and exploiting women. And today, that has happened. And people have seen him for who he is, not this mild-mannered guru self-help leader. He's a vile monster and he deserves to be behind bars. And Ranieri's attorneys maintain his innocence, saying he is proud of his life's work and determined to fight in this case. His latest bid, however, for a new trial was rejected by a judge just last week. Robin. All right, Amy, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.